Good evening and welcome to another edition of What's Happening in Stark County. I'm Susie Vitale and our first guest this evening is Chris Kenny, who's the Director of Education at the William McKinley Presidential Library and Museum. You're here to talk about a lot of programs and I don't even take notes when you're coming on. I just say, what are you, what's new? What's going on over there? Well, this time of year we get very busy. We're, mm -hmm. we're busy all year round, but it seems like during the holidays we kind of step it up a little bit. So mm -hmm. we've got a, a lot of events uh, the first few weeks in December and mm -hmm. then after Christmas as well. Mm -hmm. uh, we start December on December 4th with our holiday open house. It's a Friday night from 6 to 8 p.m. It's free for museum members. If you're not a museum member, you really should be. You should uh, be. You should That's be. Right. But if you are not, then it's $5 per person mm -hmm. uh, to come in. And it's a great night. We have uh, Santa is there with a live reindeer in Discover World. We have uh, refreshments provided by our museum auxiliary. I do open hearth cooking and you can get samples of donuts and cider. Oh. Uh, and the museum, of course, is beautifully decorated. Mm -hmm. uh, our exhibit in the Keller Gallery is Life in Miniature, our Dollhouse in Miniature exhibit. And it's just a very, very um, fun evening. Uh, we ask folks if you come, if you could bring a canned good, and we will uh, donate that to the, the folks that need that in the community as well. Mm -hmm. So that's just a, just a great evening. How nice. That's really a nice event to start off the Christmas yes. season. And then a week after that uh, is kind of a uh, very special event. It's our holiday open hearth dinner. Mm -hmm. And I think this is the fourth year or so that we've done that. And we cook an entire meal over the open fire in the cabin in the Street of Shops. And our guests can um, reserve spaces, a seat, a whole table if they want, in the Street of Shops and you actually get to eat right in there. I was going to say now, when you say we cook over the car, do you mean the people that sign up for this cook? Or no, do you, we, you, um, you do I, I do the cooking. Um, Kim helps out as well, mm -hmm. and we have a, a wonderful volunteer, Bill Gooch, who comes in and helps me as well. So it's a team effort. Uh, I know you to do, do a that. fantastic meal. And it's a, it's a full course meal. You have soup and uh, pan fried chicken breasts and green beans and hot cabbage and wow. bread and apple pie and oh. uh, it's just great and mm -hmm. the, the street of shops is beautifully decorated we have a, a live violinist playing Christmas music uh, so those reservations go pretty fast you do need say. reservations for that yeah yeah so sold out every year sold out every year so we hope it hope it sells out this year as well I'm sure it will okay what else is going on well after Christmas when mm -hmm. uh, when that's all over and you're looking for something for the kids to do mm -hmm. um, since they've opened all of their presidents and they uh, haven't gone back to school yet we're doing some uh, science classes mm -hmm. for them it's our three by three science samplers and it's for grades one through three and it's uh, three hours, three days, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, the 28th, 29th, and 30th of December. And we have a different science theme each day. And you can sign up for one day or you can sign up for all, all three days. Mm -hmm. uh, and again, you do need reservations uh, for those as well. And then also on the, on the 30th of December, we're having a Bring Your Doll to Tea uh, we do a series of programs called Tea with the Curator, mm -hmm. and this is the second year that we've done a Tea with the Curator for kids, and uh, the little girls mainly, uh, sure. and big girls too, bring their dolls, and uh, they have Tea with the Curator, and then they hear a program, and this year they'll go up and see the dollhouses in the Keller Gallery. Oh, how fun, how fun, what a wonderful time. So a lot going on in mm -hmm. December at the museum. Okay, and people can come and just kind of wander around too when they're over there. Oh, I mean, absolutely. Decorated, it's, it, it is. It's decorated throughout. It throughout. just mm -hmm. gets you in the mood. It does, it does. The street is my favorite when they decorate that. It's just beautiful. It is. There. It's beautiful. And, and you just feel like you're back in the day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's so nice that you let people go in those stores. Too. Oh, yes. Yep, they can walk Peek through. Peek in the windows, some of those places. Right. I'm glad that's still there. Oh, yes. We would never want to do anything with that. Uh, you know, we... We keep the artifacts rotating in the street when we can, but we know that that's a favorite, so we don't do anything with that. Okay, if somebody wants to call for more information, what's the phone number? 455-7043, and they can also go online, mckinleymuseum.org. Okay, thanks so much for coming. Thank you. Hi, I'm Susie Vitale. I've been hosting the show, What's Happening in Stark County, for close to 20 years. What's Happening is brought to you by the Community Television Consortium of Stark County. If your nonprofit organization would like to appear on our show 
or if you want to become involved with producing local television in the Stark County area, please check out our website at www.ctctv.org. You can get all the information you need to get involved with the CTC. Thanks for watching.